Merry Meet Everybody. It's been a very long time. Hope everyone's doing good. Uh, I'm kind of making a comeback to the channel, little bits and pieces, not a lot, because I still haven't moved yet. But this video, oh my gosh, I wanted to talk about witch talk. Oh dear gosh. I just recently decided to start making videos on there, which by the way, I'll put a link in there if you guys want to follow me on witch talk. Um, I'm going to be doing experiment, experiment two. I probably will not continue doing the witch talk. I only made a couple of videos. I did get into a debate with another witch on witch talk or not a witch. She was a so-called seer um, and priest, priestess, supposedly. Uh, I, I say that because if you go watch the channel or watch it, you'll see what I'm talking about. But anyway, the Witch Talk channel in general, I've noticed that there was a lot of bullshit. There was a lot of drama going on. I decided not to butt my head into that drama. You had people, a group of people, trying to hex the fae. I'm like, the f Hex the Fae, what the fuck? Hex the Fae, Hex the Moon, Hex the Underworld, Hex the Sun. I'm like, you guys, oh my God. And then you have people commenting and replying, making videos, adding on to the drama, just feeding into that bullshit. Like we all know damn well as witches, you cannot hex the Fae, you cannot hex the moon, you cannot mex, hex the mex, oh my God, hex the sun, etc. You can't do that. And then there are I hate to say it, there is a lot of gatekeeping in the witch talk community. What I mean by gatekeeping is not giving people advice. Gatekeeping is straight up just telling people, hey, you can't do that. That's, that's not what that represents. That's not what that candle represents. That's not what that herb represents. That's, that, that, that oh my God, the witchcraft has, witchcraft in general does not have rules. Now, of course, pay respect to closed traditions and etc. Of course, be respectful, but there's still really no rules in the craft. Like for example, I might associate one color with this type of magic or might associate with this feeling, but so another witch will use it for something else. And if a witch on there tells me that that's not what that represents, then that's gatekeeping. Um, so anyway, like I said, I decided to start making a witch talk channel please don't mind the noise in the background because that's my portable air conditioner which you can see right there and it's hot as balls in here and i'm not taking it off yes i know i'm wearing a sweater but i don't care um well not really a sweater but it's kind of like a sweater but anyway so besides that witch talk crap i like i said well continuing a little bit more i'm going to be making my channel i'm going to be making it on TikTok more to help some of the baby witches on the channel because I noticed too that a lot of people refuse to help the baby witches. They are, they're like no, even though sometimes some of the baby witches on there don't deserve it because the, the uh, biggest issue on there is that you state your opinion, you get ripped to shreds immediately, ripped to shreds. So fuck that shit. But I'm still gonna continue on there. So comments below and let me know if I should continue doing it. I just made a channel today if I should do that full force. On the other note, besides that, I have been, so I've been at work a lot, non-stop. I recently had a tooth pulled about four, maybe five days ago on this side. It's starting to not hurt anymore. Thank you, Akate. Um, in my path, I'm like more, definitely more eclectic. I would consider myself a Hecatean. Hecatean. I guess Hecatean witch and a neo pagan Hellenistic witch. All those terms. Mostly Hecata. Oh my god. That's mostly Hecatean, Hecatean witch. But that's where my path is leading now. Uh, there are several things I'm going through right now that some things I'm keeping private because I don't want not a lot of people knowing about what I'm doing on the sideline. That's pretty much it. I really missed everybody on here. I really did. 
So I'm gonna link my TikTok channel down below. Let me know, I've, or that's you give me ideas of what videos to make on TikTok. I'm still trying to learn how to operate the shit all the way because I'm used to t YouTube format. I'm not used to TikTok. I'm not used to it. So, like I said, give me ideas. I'll be making more videos on here. Uh, try and think of what my next video should be. Comment down below too on what videos should should be next on the YouTube channel too. Until next time, Mary Park, blessed be.